Erosion. Have you ever wondered how the surface of Earth gets many of its different shapes? It's partly because of erosion. Erosion is the process that breaks things down. During erosion, small pieces of rock or soil move from one place to another. So, you can think of erosion as a way that bigger things are broken down into smaller things. The usual tool of erosion is water. Think about a rock that you pick up at the ocean or in a river. It is probably very smooth. That's because, over time, water has worn off all the sharp pieces. Now think about the mud next to a river or stream. That's an example of erosion. The water is brown because it has taken away many tiny bits of soil. And the shape of the river or stream is changed, even if only a little. Water can even break large boulders. It doesn't seem like water is strong enough to break down and carve out rock, does it? However, moving water is amazingly powerful. One famous example of erosion by water is the Grand Canyon. For five million years, the rushing water of the Colorado River broke off small pieces of rock and carried them away toward the sea. Today, the Grand Canyon is one mile deep and, in some places, 18 miles wide. And it's all because of erosion. Erosion also changes the shape of coastlines. Waves hit rocks over and over again. The rocks break and the water takes them away. On a sandy beach, the waves take away the sand and put it somewhere else. Wow, did you ever think that the same water you drink could change Earth's surface? Did you know at the bottom of the Grand Canyon are rocks that are 1.8 billion years old? <laughs>